Grade 12 Biology allows students an in-depth look at the processes occurring in the biological systems all around them and even inside their own bodies. Throughout the course, students will study theory and conduct investigations across many fascinating fields of biology. SBI for you will cover the following units. Biochemistry. Have you ever wondered how chemotherapy drugs are used to target tumor cells? Or what role nanotechnologies might play in replacing current diagnostic and treatment technologies? In this unit, you will gain an understanding of how the technological applications that affect biological processes and cellular functions are used in the food, pharmaceutical, and medical industries. You will also learn that biochemical compounds play important structural and functional roles in the cells of all living organisms. Metabolic Processes If you've ever made a drastic change to your diet, you know that it's important to first understand how cells in your body will react to the introduction of new substances or the removal of others. In this unit, you will learn that this is due to the fact that all metabolic processes involve chemical changes and energy conversions. This understanding will allow you to make informed choices about range of personal, societal, and environmental issues. Molecular Genetics Have you ever wondered who controls your personal genetic information? Who should have access to our DNA and who gets to decide how it is used? In this unit, you will learn that DNA contains all the genetic information for any given living organism and that proteins control a vast number of cellular processes. We will also discuss the social, legal, and ethical implications of genetic research and biotechnology. Homeostasis Do you know how common antidepressants work? Or why people, especially the young, should be carefully monitored when on these kinds of medications? What about the links between air pollution and asthma? In this unit, we will discuss the topic of homeostasis, where you will learn that all organisms have strict limits on the internal conditions they can tolerate. We will also examine how all systems that maintain homeostasis rely on feedback mechanisms, which can be affected by a variety of environmental factors.